Championship club Burton Albion rely heavily on their academy to produce players, seeing as they don't have the budget of other clubs. It's hugely important. It's, it's important for a number of reasons, not only uh, to develop players for our first team, which is, is key, but also to, to build a relationship with the local community um, and basically ensure that uh, there is a pathway for local talented players to progress into the first team, which is uh, which what every supporter wants to see with their first team, and uh, it's what we want to see as a club. Well, with with us being the club we are and uh, the size we are at this stage, um, obviously we, we've had a, a fantastic rise uh, over the last few years, um, and now to to be playing in the championship. Um, it's really important for us to be able to compete with the big clubs that we're not only doing well in, in selecting players from other clubs to bring into the club, but we're producing our own players that fit the philosophy of the club, um, being hard-working, well-rounded young players um, that, that can really show the first team and the, the, the Burton uh, public that we can develop players to play at that level as well. Coach Sam Rose stressed how important the academy was, not just for Burton, but for the community itself. It's, it's really important. Um, the club's really uh, well uh, grounded in the community. Um, and I think that alongside the community trust work that goes on, um, you know, the academy um, adds uh, you know, another opportunity to give local kids a, a chance to progress um, and you know, hopefully achieve the, the dream of being a professional footballer. It's, it's important you know, with a club of Burton Albion size to support you know, the, the progression and the, 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 um, the success of the first team with you know, local young professional footballers. This is Dean Cook reporting from St George's Park.